Hey, Hickok 45 here. Vlog 11, sitting in the woods, enjoying Mother Nature. Uh, been on vacation this week. You've uh, maybe seen a few more videos posted than normal. Got old Ginger with us. You're getting tired, baby. Uh, so hopefully you've caught those, and uh, hopefully you've caught all the old videos. You know, we have a lot of videos posted uh, now, over 150, and uh, I still get questions uh, that are answered, you know, in some of the videos. So if I seem to be brief in an answer and a PM, uh, you know, it, it might be because I've explained that in a video or two, uh, you know, maybe even extensively. But anyway, and speaking of messages, uh, i still getting a lot of them, and of course, I, I prefer you, you send your questions in, uh, you know, private message because it's easier to answer and, and maintain, uh, but it is, it is a lot, of course. So if you can keep your questions uh, as concise as you can, as, I guess, well stated, uh, make it clear what the question is, that sort of thing, and maybe not have too many questions in one, one uh, email or, or private message, that would help too. One thing that's definitely a problem and that is uh, follow-up questions, uh, follow-up replies and such. It's not like email, as you know, and I don't see your original question, and it, it gets humorous at times. This happens almost every day, because it's not like normal correspondence with uh, you know, a buddy or somebody, because you don't have the, the previous messages attached and all that sort of thing, but what, what happens, it's so funny, uh, I'll be, I get up in the morning and you know maybe 5 a.m. or 4 a.m. I'm I'm just going through messages you know, and I'll open one and you know like eight, nine, ten, fifteen of them and I'll open one and there'll be uh, it'll just say, so what length barrel, you know, <laughs> or uh, which Glock, or you know and I, I don't know what I don't know what you're talking about you know well it may be like 30, 40, 50, 100 messages back you ask me a question. Uh, about what I thought was the best Glock for hunting wild boar or some some question could be anything of course and uh, And then I get you know 100 questions or 50 or 20 but between those and so I and I, I don't even have time to really hardly notice th uh, who they're from because I don't know you know Enough of you to I, I, as I said I've got some some folks some regulars that I notice and that I know and it have been around a long time And I always notice your messages and who it's from and everything but but there's still a lot of people with a lot of you know crazy uh, usernames, I don't necessarily remember them. And, and anyway, I get a lot of that. So it's it's almost like someone has Alzheimer's, you know. And you're sitting there talking to them and say, "Well, where do you want to go today? Oh, I don't know. Let's drive to Nashville. Okay. Uh, you know, where are we going to have lunch? Lunch? Why? Where are we going? Yeah. I mean, it's it's one of those conversations with someone who uh, has a, a memory of say 10 seconds. You know. So that's what it it reminds me of. So it, I guess the answer to that might be if. Uh, uh, just restate the question, you know, clearly, you know, say, uh, you know, so what length barrel would you require or would you recommend in a, in a uh, 40 caliber or, you know, just be more precise so that I would know exactly what you're asking. Okay. So I know that that sounds odd, but I get so many messages that, you know, I could go back and dig through and search five pages back and everything. Uh, it's just, I can't get to all the messages. So anyway, I know you understand that. So I'm just trying to stay with it as long as I can uh, answering messages. I, I never neglect a message. I may not answer one because there's not really a question, but uh, I respond to almost all of them. And uh, so I want to keep doing that as long as I can. Uh, we may be getting close to where that's, that's very difficult. Um, <laughs> same, along the same lines, I get uh, a lot of videos shared with me. And I'm basically using one of those 3G cards. Uh, from Verizon, so lots of times I, I just can't only have the time or can't run a video. So if I haven't responded to a video you've shared or sent, uh, you know, please understand that I, I get to look at very few of those, very few of those. Uh, some of the questions I don't answer that I get regularly, and you see them in comments, you see them on my profile, uh, and I get more than that, of course, just in private messages like, "Hey, man, how many guns you have, or uh, how much that gun cost?" and uh, how do you store your guns? Uh, what powder charge are you using? It? Those are questions I just don't answer. You, most of you figured that out by now. I just don't uh, answer those questions. I don't recommend powder charges for you know reloading. And since I started doing the reloading videos, trying to help out there too, I'm getting a lot more questions about that. Uh, please understand, I can't uh, 
give a reloading seminar in every email message or private message. Uh, uh, we'll answer questions. By and large, I'm doing the videos to answer questions. You know, uh, well, I mean, a lot of reasons to do the videos, but in those videos, I try to answer the questions. If I continue to get a, a question over and over, that's sort of the basis for a new video. You know, kind of how that works out. Uh, things that come to my mind just from my experience, or uh, I can continue to get the same question. Uh, I'll just, yeah, maybe I need to do a video on that. You know, so that's kind of how that comes about. But I can't. Uh, I've had actual questions. Uh, you know, explain how you reload and what you do that well it would take four paragraphs which I don't have time to write uh, but if I get questions like that often enough I will uh, maybe do a video on it but please understand I don't mean to give anybody short shrift uh, in an answer uh, you know and I still get the course of questions which gun would you recommend which Glock would you recommend etc cetera, etc cetera. I think I've kind of answered most of that uh, in my Glock videos uh, for the most part uh, you might want to go back and look at, at, at those if you have still have questions about that you know I, I like the, the smaller glocks uh, unless I'm out on the range I'm hunting uh, wild boar which I haven't done yet uh, from in the mountains you know uh, watching out for grizzly bears you know those are different situations but other than those you know I like the glock 27 the 26 the 19 and the 23 those are my favorite glocks any one of them will do uh, what else was I gonna mention oh yeah uh, we got some videos. We still got some more videos coming up, of course. Uh, uh, wanted to uh, let you know we have a, another rapid fire video coming down the pike, rapid fire two that John, my son, has been working on here lately, and uh, so kind of watch out for that. Uh, probably next weekend we'll uh, get that one posted. I think he'll have the edit. That's those are you know edited videos where uh, he puts his creativity to work and uh, does a good job on those. Uh, makes me look good uh, what else so oh, yeah we did a oh yeah we did a video that we'll be posting here on uh, the AK and the AR-15 which uh, I pretty much covered in the video but uh, please let's not have a big battle you know about which of those guns is better you know uh, it's been my experience in those kinds of videos that people just go crazy and uh, really come out of the woodwork sometimes but uh, they're both great guns, and uh, that's kind of the approach I take in that video. And it's just really a, an opportunity to shoot both guns and uh, show them, and, you know, for people that maybe don't have one or the other, or both, uh, that kind of thing. I like both those guns. Decided to do a little video on them. Uh, I'll never do a video like some people have done, where they really uh, could uh, stick that in an encyclopedia, you know, in terms of the information. But uh, so we have a little fun shooting those guns, and you'll be seeing that really soon. And I can't think of anything other lies I need to tell you. Ginger, is there anything else they need to know? We do appreciate the support. Uh, uh, you know, the subscriptions are growing up over 12,000 now, the views, uh, which are the important thing. And uh, it's, it's going really well still. Uh, we've got the best uh, group of viewers and subscribers, I think, out there. I'll have to say, it is extremely rare that uh, we get the really weird stuff you know you see it it happens occasionally but it's it's rare and uh, that's kind of nice so I think that's all I had to tell you and since Ginger doesn't have anything <laughs> to share do you baby uh, I need to do a video on golden retrievers if you've ever had a golden retriever you can't stop petting them you know so he will not let you stop because <laughs> they're big babies aren't you big babies so we, you probably think I'm sitting over here unarmed in zombie country. Ginger, won't you go on away? Because look what I'm going to do. Go on, go on. I'm going to fire again. Go on. Bye bye. Bye bye. <laughs>45 signing off glad you can come to the woods and visit us here this uh, beautiful afternoon take care life is good even if I can't hear <laughs>